I already checked up on that. Control. Don't need to watch that again. <laughs> and my goodness, there's already three people here in the Bjorn, Monarchy, and Ariel. Welcome on in, the people. Uh, you're gonna swim or you're gonna like it. Uh, I can swim, I just haven't for a very long time due to uh, a bit of a past issue. <laughs> I think I brought it up before that. Um, <clears throat> That back in 2009, during the summer, I went swimming at the public pool. I was out there for like three and a half hours. I got the worst fucking sunburn of my life. I like blisters dripping down my back, and <laughs> it fucking hurt for like three weeks. So that's kind of why I don't really go swimming much anymore. Swim phobia. Well, kind of going. I'm kind of going into the game here. So anyway, welcome in all you fancy ghouls and goblins out there to day ten of Fort and Terrific Halloween. And they were checking out an Xbox arcade game called Hydrophobia. I had never um, played this game before, but I figured it'd be perfect for the Halloween season one. Funny story: there was this pool in a hotel me and my friends went to. It was pretty damn shallow, like the deepest it went was six feet deep. And me being six three, my head just popped out of the water. As everyone doing this morning, I am doing about as well as I can be. I kind of was late to streaming today, just was about 10 minutes off, but um, you know, I ended up waking up a little bit late anyway, so, but other than that, I'm doing just fine. I'm just gonna bring this up just a little bit so you guys can see something. Contrast, just a little bit. Good to you guys. <coughs> Been pretty stressed there yesterday. Just want to rely on these streams today. But hopefully, you can do just that. Y axis land, swim. Of course, keep it at normal because I'm going to play on inverted difficulties or inverted controls to fucking contest. Waypoints, yeah, all that sort of normal. Game saved it automatically, of course, as most games do. Any sound I can fix up in here? Fix that up a little bit. That should be just fine. Yeah. Worst sunburn I got wasn't from swimming, it was from the ATV camp. We were riding around the hills during a heat wave and my arms were boiling hot. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Yeah, it's worse when you're directly in the sun and you don't, like, have any protection on you. That's basically what happened to me. I hardly had any sun screen on and I got fucking roasted. <laughs> Subtitles? Yes. Don't know why that's always a default. Good no. So y'all back to understand something. How to play? Don't need to see that. Controls, credits, whatever. Challenge room. Around, watching movie scenes on YouTube, and YouTube and I can collect. I got a bad summer when I was a kid and visited Portugal. It's so red everyone called me a Danish sausage. <laughs> oh, that's not good. No, I should make that. Okay, anyway. Let's get right to the game here. This will overwrite your existing game progress. There is no game progress. What the fuck? It was a horrible day to be shirtless. Deck docks, but yeah, I got it. <laughs> <coughs> Fuck. Sorry, let's So I think we're gonna go ahead on easy here, since we have no idea what the hell this game's got going for us. <laughs> you stole it. You stole my life. Cave of sorts. Part of 
hard Irish. You don't go outside too much. The sun is my enemy. Same here, man. It's just fucking the Irish side of me. Just fucking burns up my skin. All sorts of crazy. And by the way, there was a jump scare there in case you didn't uh, catch that. And why do I look like the main character from Beyond Good and Evil? You're watching live, uninterrupted coverage of the Queen of the World's 10th anniversary. That's literally who I look like. It's about the green lipstick. The so-called party of the century is being watched eagerly around the globe as we wait anxiously for Nanocell's historic announcement. An announcement By the way, Beyond Good and Evil is something I plan on playing in the future. Hope of feeding the countless billions left in desperation by the ever-rising tide of the global population flood. Earlier, we caught up with Nanocell CEO John Bolton to discuss the enormous responsibility his company now carries on its shoulders. Apparently, John Dalton couldn't give a fuck because he's just launching a bunch of worthless fireworks in the air, causing more of the ozone layer to be tear apart by the, uh, the, by the combustion. We have to know that we serve a greater purpose. Wants to give back to the world. She looks like a discount Lara Croft. Eh, a little bit. Oh, fancy thing. Don't know if any of you heard. They're remastering Tomb Raiders 1, 2, and 3. And they're putting it all on a package next February. Only in a couple months now. February 13th, I believe it is. The day before Valentine's Day. So I may or may not get to playing that. Alright, so. Just tell me how to go over this way. Wait, hold up. Object. So our name is Kate Wilson. That's our character's name here. And we got some sleeping pills. Contains diphen. diphenhydramine. Specifically used to cause drowsiness and increase the levels. Yeah, fucking. <clears throat> Those are some great 2010? I don't know, when did this game come out? Let me check the game card. Don't crash on the Xbox. 2010, I was right. <laughs> right on the money. <laughs> Look at his apartment, yeah. Huh? I mean, this is pretty much the base apartment that all these fucking people have. She even has a fucking exercise bike in here. She's got a fucking elliptical right in the middle of her floor here. What's it called? The TK-800? Or the TX-800? Can I actually use this fucking thing? No. <clears throat> I hate when certain games have objects in there that you can't fucking use. Like, just even as like a little goof, you can't use them. Object, climber's choice, weighted wrist sprint. Oh my god, she is Lara Croft. <laughs> She's got wristbands, sleeping pills. And there she is. Don't know why it said hold to skip when it wasn't really much of anything. Oh, she's an Oxford student. How wonderful. Went in there for systems engineering. <coughs> uh, <coughs> oh, fuck. Sorry. I was so blocked up in my sinuses today. <laughs> For someone that looks like she's got a crack orgy, she has a flushed out house. <laughs> what is this? Certificate of Achievement. This certificate is word to Katie Wilson, grade 7, for outstanding achievement in swimming. She kept that shit. Since grade seven, Coach Leanne Nolan. Is that supposed to be some way to tie in the whole title of the game? You turn into a terror. <laughs> eh, yeah, sorry about that. <clears throat> that picture looks like it's from Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah, well, the graphics weren't too, um,. Refined by then. Oh, look at this shit, man. These are basically what smart ovens are like now. With like the touchpad things here. Like so much for thinking about what the future would be like. Scoot. I'm not getting 
if you keep calling me when you're off duty, Miss Olsen. My system just went down. Anything I should know about? The party of the century is happening on your doorstep. And you're staying at home. <laughs> guy's name's Scoot. I'm going to check on the network. Oh, Scoot. That's a huge microwave. Yeah, it's just like, who needs that big a stoof? Up oh, there's a helicopter. And the helicopter man got blinded by all the fireworks in the air. We really should be launching these things in low air spaces. Party of the century. Looks like the party of the century is underway. You would have thought people would reserve judgment until they actually hear what Nanocell's announcement is. If they don't deliver, we could have a riot on our hands. Yeah, that is possible. I do like how some of the things have physics, though. Just fucking... Just kick the fucking chair around. You can go read that book. What book? This one? Hmm. Classical Engineering. From the Industrial Revolution to the city at sea and the new frontier of nanoengineering, Jay Houlihan. <laughs> Fucking Jay Houlihan. Guides us through mankind's remarkable journey of engineering. Citing key lessons from history, Houlihan explores... I'm sorry, I can't help but laugh at the name Houlihan. That's just too ridiculous. <laughs> Houlihan explores the notion of engineering as savior and suggests that although our world may be beyond repair, hope remains if we seek to build a better, diff a different kind of future. One that preferably doesn't have the name Houlihan. <laughs> Everything has physics, except the important parts. We used to have a few swimming badges, I don't know where they are now, may I throw them out, oh no. <laughs> Samsung is so obsessed with turning washing machines into phones, like bro, I want to wash my clothes on open Facebook. I mean, they've been doing that shit for like years now. <laughs> Did Jay Houlihan marry J Jacob Houlihop? Almost a match reference right there. <laughs> Yeah, almost there. Just a little close off the edge. <laughs> Alright, what the fuck are you are? Shuttle station platform C2. Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Wake up and smell the ashes. Well, there's no harm in checking, is there, Scoot? I just love that her friend's called Scoot. <laughs> Where are you? I'm just by the uh, uh, security post. Oh, jeez, that's him. Diesel, why are you down down there? I'm working so that you can have the night off. Motherfucker looks like a mix between Adam Sandler and James Corden. Adam Sandler would like that that shaved head, and James Corden because he's fat. <laughs> Who the hell sleeps in rock climbing gear? Apparently she does. Oh no, the elevator done exploded. That are not a good. Who would have thought that anything would go wrong in an elevator in an action game? He looks like your stereotypical Discord mod. He does. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, so they built this ship because of rising water. So what's powering the ship? It's water. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Who's <laughs> Jenny? Uh, Scoot, uh, you? Of course it's me. Are you okay? Can you move? I just want to ride a bike, damn it. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. <laughs> Jesus! Where am I? My name's not Jesus, Kate. It's Is fucking it's Scoot. Scoot. I know something that Scoot talks like Raj from Camp Laszlo. He has that sort of uh, elevating voice all the time, just cause going up in the air. So he's not Indian. <clears throat> oh, oh my god! <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Just one tap of the flyer, just ragdolled back down to the surface. That was that was special. 
<laughs> was I expecting that? This counts. Oh, ah, so we got discount craft and discount awesome. Scotty. You can get to that protection there. Well, did you expect this game to be anything original? <laughs> the movie and gaming industry just have a common hatred for elevators and I swear it's a 90% chance they're gonna explode. Jesus. I mean Who did this? Did, did they just fucking <laughs> Did you hear that? They threw the fucking Wilhelm scream at us. Just legitimately. As that guy was falling, you hear the ah! <laughs> Just immediately down there. Are you fucking kidding me? They couldn't even find an actor to record a scream for that character dying. Oh my god. <laughs> this is fucking ridiculous so far. <laughs> A door? There's a, it's not like there's a way to open it or anything. My security level has been reset. Another Wilhelm family member is perished. God damn. The well, it's not that fucking old, man. It's like, it was 2010. They could have afforded to get actors back then. Okay, scan it. There's a console on the level above. Hang on. Level one. The system without us knowing. They couldn't. That's what worries me. Oh no, water on the screen. That's truly terrifying. Hydrophobia. Access denied. Right. Download the hot program for the central console. Gotcha, buddy. Officer, I need to use that console. Sorry, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, who'd have saw that coming? Uh, he's dead. Yates is dead. What? <laughs> the monitors. Like shows sure alerted by the this railing. It's like, it's what a railing? Who put this here? Is this? You want to know the strangest scene for a Wilhelm scream? Friggin' My Little Pony Friends of the Magic had one in the background during a party. Wait, just they just throw it in the randomest of places, man. Mav hacking module. When the user does not possess the correct frequency key, they can attempt to manually override a system firewall with this module. Primarily used by security engineers for system maintenance. Okay, I've got it. We're gonna have to hack back into our own system. It's the only way to regain your security access. Now get to security control, it's back past the elevator. Subject briefing from Chief C. Billingham to Officer P. Yates. Officer Yates, I know I promised you downtime for the celebrations, but you know that duty to our ship comes first. So while I am interrogating this punk, I need you to step up and keep watch at the station. I want to be <coughs> kept informed of anything suspicious. Command might have classified Mila as trivial, but down here we follow our guts, not a textbook. We don't follow any of that pansy ass shit down here. We're not raised to read, we're raised to fight, damn it. <laughs> yeah, it's Wait a second. Yeah, it's gonna explode. It's gonna explode. What is yeah, that? Stop the slow walking, alright? We know it's gonna fucking explode. We hear the ticking. It just Just do it already. Well, I guess it ain't. Yep. What a fucking shocker. I I'm running from an explosion, Scoot. Those not only much time to fucking make way for conversation. I'm okay. Ah, the door won't open. I can't get out. The circuits are fried. You'll have to hide the emergency release. UK folk just hate the letter T. Yeah, massive ships. The only real reason the ship is down is powered has to be nuclear unless they find out how to do fusion. Maybe they just got a bunch of pig farts down there. I don't know. Damn. I can't get to it. Well, guess we're taking the long way around. Hoopa. Oh god, we gotta do the balance shit. 
Alright. Ooh, do the hula. Console. Oh god, we're doing this shit. Tinker. He's a tinker. I... Nope, oh, damn it. If I could just fucking straight out the camera, please. Blah. Save the world, save yourself. And I'm working on it, buddy. Oh no, workers. Oh, they're... Nice to get those guys. <laughs> yeah, but those guys aren't. Oh, fuck. Thought I could clear that gap there, but... Where they put me? I'm working on it. Uh, I'm at the... Uh, get past this here. Where is that? Wasn't there a video of someone that was still alive in a sunken ship and someone was sinking, swimming around it? The rivers reached out and grabbed the swimmer? I mean, I'm sure there is, but I don't fucking know. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm missing a lot of. I love Scoot Go. Knew when you died. <laughs> Scariest video I remember seeing was a dude swimming under a frozen lake. He was trying to reach the other open section, but he got lost and almost couldn't get out. Oh, jeez. Luckily, he did. So if UK pronounces it wa and US pronounces it water. Who actually pronounces it with a T? Probably Africans, I don't know. They have a Batman thing going on. This is Batman Lara Croft's daughter. <laughs> Jeez. I'm actually, you know, there are certain games that I want to go back to. There's a lot of old games that I want to go back to. Now that you brought up Batman, um, of course I'm just talking about Arkham City, but um, like Batman Vengeance for the PS2, I want to go back and do that one. <laughs> I remember getting that one from Blockbuster a couple times. Oh, those are great water physics. <laughs> oh dear. Those look like fucking jelly popping up. <laughs> good thing I swam. Good thing I was a good swimmer in seventh grade. Hey, what the fuck? You lose this um, ladder here. Oh, I had to fucking do something. Yeah. I forgot I had to climb on these pipes here. There's always room for jello. Oh. But that game where it's like a bunch of people dressed up as a Batman. Dressed up as a Batman. <laughs> Sorry. Dressed up as Batman pointing them. That pains that um that PS3 game. I'd have to track that down. But. And I think that game you were talking about, um I think it was Gotham City Imposters. I think that was the one you were talking about. Oh hell. Well that wasn't smart. <laughs> oh fuck me, I'll be back here. Okay, so... Yep. 
Pipe is over here. And point, and point. Oh shit. <laughs> so we gotta make it to a door before that thing. Oh my god, no. Go down, you. Try to go down, but one let me go down. Son of a bitch. Third time's the charm. Yeah, we made it. Search body. Sure, we'll just take. We'll just rob these dead bodies of their hard earned money. Your goddamn security system's got me trapped in here. <laughs> this is all your fault, you stupid woman. Okay. I always do the women were good for nothing. <laughs> They're up to the PS6 by now! <laughs> and the Xbox mini fridge is just doubled in size. They still don't have any exclusives for them! What does it say? Save the world. Kill yourself. on the door lock. What the hell? <laughs> I love how the what the hell there didn't have fucking any punctuation. Gotta find a way up there, Kate. Yeah, no shit. How do I use the... Can't do shit. Guess we'd be climbing. <laughs> I'm fighting for my life down here. Send Twinkies. There's gonna be a switch too. Yeah. They keep talking about that switch too, but I don't know how likely it is it's gonna happen. And they don't really keep in touch with uh, Nintendo stuff at all. I won't let you finish, but uh, I'll look at this here. A 10th anniversary commemorative coin. Struck in pure platinum to matchless proof quality, this exclusive 10th anniversary coin makes an absolutely stunning collector coin. One that every lover of rare and beautiful things would treasure forever. The coin comes handsomely presented and complete with a certifi certificate of authenticity guaranteeing its specifications and stringent limited edition of just 1,000 coins. Nazi shit. Not sure how that helps me, but frequency key. There we are. Maybe they'll get the cipher for the other three complex. Yeah. Scoot, I found something. It looks like a frequency key. It's a Mavi E vision program. Let's see if I can decode it. Yeah, let's see if you can, bitch. Cipher scan. Okay. Mavi map. Oh, hello. What does this say? Oh, there's a bunch of stuff here. 
upper security complex. We shed our need for fear. We are not crippled by misdirected compassion. We see with clarity the coming storm and are ready to embrace it with our lives. The reprobates will respond to their fear predictably by now. Gartland has led its forces into our trap and Billingham's attention is consumed by our brother Wilkinson. You will free Wilkinson from Billingham's cell and together you will neutralize him. Kill all who stand in your way and return to the shuttle plaza. Hang on. There's some kind of cipher. Jesus, it looks like mission orders for the terrorists. The code for the local door controls. It's embedded in the file. How long have they been plotting this? And damn engineers. Move it! Right. Oh, that was easy. Didn't have to do anything. What a bunch of hard work decrypting is. Just had to watch things on a screen. Can I, can I get off? Oh, I just had to hit B. Right. The one time I actually wanted to hit B <clears throat> to get down. Paper! No! Killed him. They killed him. I switch two. The switch hasn't been fully used. They just want Nintendo to be kicked up in the fucking console things, I guess. What the hell is her accent? Is she British or American? That's the same way I felt with uh, Lucia from Devil May Cry 2. She would switch in and out between accents. Like, she would have a Latin accent at one point, and then a typical American one. It's like, you gotta pick one or the other, bitch. Can't be both. <laughs> Sight scan module. Okay. Nice to do. <clears throat> no, I've been... Oh, fuck. Alright. We got time. Can I start to reach out now? Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Move those Lara Croft legs, Kate. Oh, it's a good thing the water didn't put out the fire. Oh, hell, oh, hell, oh, hell. Oh, jeez. Okay, fucking... They want to destroy none ourselves. Uh, oh god, oh god. <laughs> well, now I just lay right perfectly in the fire. Okay. I'm on a fucking roll. I'm going, Kate. Oh, I found out who these lunatics are. They call themselves the Neo Malthusians. Malthusians? The terrorists, Kate. Fanatics of a twisted solution. What is the significance of Malthusians? Global genocide. Save the world. Kill yourself. They want to destroy none of cells research. They're gonna sink the ship. Like, what you see is going No like, shit, Kate. <sighs> Quick, Kate, use the sight scan, open the door. Sight scan. Maybe. Malfunction. Oh, I'm never gonna let him live this down. My hero. Academia? Not building them out. Hell no. Anything else I can hear? A document. Title interrogation. Chief Billingham. You don't want to be stuck in the cell while everybody else is celebrating. Of course you don't. You're a patriot. I'm sure this whole thing is just a nasty misunderstanding. <clears throat> Which is what all we politicians are forced to say. 
Nothing like bacon during times like during the end times. It's kind of Irish. Yeah. I don't know about it. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play a little game I like to call Honesty Corner. The rules are simple. Every time you tell the truth, you move a step closer to getting out of here in time for the fireworks. Every time you lie, you get to feel the blunt end of my LP4. <laughs> my long penis 4. <laughs> and we extend your stay a little longer. First, you're going to tell me about Mila. Where she is, what kind of stunt she's planning, and how many times she's going to keep voicing Meg on Family Guy. <laughs> and how many low-life proles such as yourself she's recruited. Let the record state that the suspect exercised his right to remain silent, and the chief exercised his right to make himself horny. <laughs> God damn it. Mila Crass. Responsible for people smuggling, tampering with secure ship systems, citizenship ID fraud, assault, resisting arrest. Please report any information to a Queen of the World security officer, Commander Jake Gartland. All right then. Chief, are you okay? You took your time, didn't you? Look, there were complications. Uh, oh, the terrorists. Oh, 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 Engineers oh, blame complications. Officers get the job done. Oh, now, maybe you want to tell me what the hell's going on with your security system. It's being compromised, sir. I need... Okay, we've got security <coughs> level one. That should unlock the main access routes. Oh, my hero. Tell the truth, you can get out. Get Lie in this, this pipe swept your head. Go to the shuttle plaza. I mean, that's basically the fucking there with your level interrogation thing. Wait, where are you going? To Fire. find a weapon. Somebody has to take and pro tip, the ship, lava, it fucking burns. Without any more complications. <laughs> Damn it. Son of a bitch. Oh, he didn't just want to show his LP collection of vinyls? We don't need that super strength. Spider-Man. Spider-Man PS4 told me to this minigame. Dude, he did the same shit in, um... Or kind of the same thing in Resident Evil 2 Remake. Where he had, uh... Do the fucking, um... Ah, uh, what, what was it? In the hospital area? There's tons of games that took that fucking minigame. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, I didn't die from that fire, apparently. Oh. Well, now I've got two balance. Okay, Kate. Balance. Breathe. <laughs> but don't breathe too much because of smoke inhalation. That's bad. Move it, Kate. The whole area is about to go under. I got you, big, burly, and fucky. Why is he telling me to use a flashlight? Like, I'm not even in a really dark area yet. No! 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 Stop! Swim! I can't swim, Jake. Or Scoot. I'm hydrophobic. Hydrophobic. I'm fucking moving, man. You fucking cake. Keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Hold the power swim. Fuck yeah. You're so close now, Kate. When you get to the plaza, take the emergency stairwell to the I'm gonna go up there, fuck. Uh, hold on. Hold on now. Uh, uh, Kate, get up. <laughs> get the fuck out of here. Okay, there any of these bodies? to the plaza. They've encrypted it. Check the bodies for a frequency key. You mean he wasn't fine in the smoke, fire smoke filled room? They had a box of cigars right there. He casually smokes. He chain smokes. <laughs> Sorry. Shuttle plaza. Ensure the puddle, shuttle puddle shaza. Ensure the shuttle plaza is secure and all rivers have been wiped out. Unit A2 will be the fucking, yeah, terrorist no. shit. Don't do fuck. The frequency key. It's not here. It's somewhere in the loading bays. Bullets. Listen, Bullocks. You've done enough for me already. 
You need to get off a deck. I'll be I have such okay. a hard time opening my eyes underwater on a high rate as in games. Yeah, I have that problem too, I man. It's like whenever I used to go swimming <clears throat> when I was younger, I always had to have like goggles on because it's like, how the fuck do you see underwater? Then again, it wasn't chlorinated pools, so it kind of makes sense for me to there. Okay, you just had to pause the game to tell me that. <laughs> had to hold Y to surface. Oh no, look at that box. It's gonna keep you from getting up. Swim, Kate. Complete. Okay, and yeah, we got an avatar war unlocked apparently. Don't know what the fuck that does for me. An LP4. Since we're on Xbox One and not Xbox 360. Finally, a lucky break. Okay, ammo. Just uh, Sonic rounds. <laughs> and they Rest. gotta go fast. Access the cyclo converters. You mean like this? Alright, how the hell am I gonna get past here? Okay, that's not a way to go. I'll try to jump up onto that wire there and see if I can swing like a Tarzan. Hold the charge sonic round. That does me. Ah, there we go. Oh wait, why did that help me? That was gonna be shocky water. Why did I do that? Oh, fuck. Damn it. The wire's causing the electric. Well, I'm a bit of a Stupid. Bam. Is there something in the water I'm supposed to fucking get? Or in this particular room? Let's try the map again. Huh, <laughs> you like how it's called Mavi and not Navi? Wonderful choice. Scripted. We got some readings there. Any more mysterious running on the walls? No. Can I use my charge shot to fucking break this open? Nope. Uh, that's that fucked me up even more. Open your beats. Some reasons are not are that salty, so you can open your beats. <laughs> so, how do you do this? I break the glass there, right? I managed to get that far. How do I have to shoot the wire? Oh, I had to shoot the wires. Did not think I could do that. Now is it safe for entrance? No, it's still not. Okay, gotta come a little bit shorter. It's gonna go right up to here. There we go. Go right at the base. And 
Last but not least, this little guy right here. Bam. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere, Chiefy boy. Bust up that word. And then we bust up this little boy here. Sweet this one a little bit more. And then in here. Can I press the button? No, I cannot. Let's try the mad me. Yes. I do see. Oh, hello. There's something over here, is there? There's just a uh, bunch of fire. And I cannot use the Sonic Rounds to push that out of the way. Okay, well. This is going to wait open for right now. We got rascals. Jesus, Scoot, you could have warned me. Kate, I've got two balls and little McCrystal. That's a good thing. Cycle converters access. Right. I've got the frequency key. It looks like the cipher's nearby. It's back that way. Before I do that, this fancy way. I don't know the point of opening those things because I don't really seem to get it much. Yeah. Oh, hello. Marker. What is that right there? Another door. What is this? Cypher. You piece of bitch. Can I take his gun? Reduce range to override. Cool business. Get through here? Nope. Of course, I gotta bust it open. Bust it wide open. Now listen, there's no CCTV in there, so be careful. Open, open. Get through. Is there that body, last body shot down? Um, now they're gonna the option too. It's like there are only certain bodies you're gonna lose. It's kind of stupid, honestly. Wait a second. That's why they would that was a lot more water coming out of there than actually was in there. Yeah, it sort of seems like it. Oh, another cycle converter, huh? Well, I think I can handle this. Oh no, it's malfunction. Never mind. I can't handle this. But I can do this, though.
do the little swimmies. Now we just do a little bit of swimming. And now we're just drenched in the water. Expecting this guy to have water guns. <laughs> no, that makes things too wet. Gotta think about this thing, son. Scoot, I've got a massive power surge here. I can't get through. It gets worse. Okay, you better see this. Follow the CCTV module. Check the console quick. <laughs> How can no one not hear you walk? Well, that's a double negative you just used there, Ariel. <laughs> Hijack module. The camera above you. Camera above me, eh? <laughs> ah, there it is. Cycle the feeds. On your knees. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Because we're generically evil. The end of righteousness is everlasting life. Okay, apparently we're fighting Bane now. Death. Those whose minds are not suited to a pure state of existence should perish and be condemned to mix well, thank the darkness is your ally. My children really adopted the darkness. I was born in it. Molded by it. Do you see why I must do what I do now, Batman? <laughs> That's literally what he fucking sounded like. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Bane. Just fucking... <laughs> ridiculous. Can I bust these windows? Do I still have to fucking do the camera thing? No! It's not your fault! Okay, none of it is. But look, you still need to overload the circuits to get through. Open the door and make those assholes pay. Well, I just did that. <laughs> you really adopted the water. Well, I want to do that again. You really adopted the water back then. I was bored in it. Drowned by it. <laughs> God damn it. Converters. The cycle converters convert an AC waveform produced by the Queen of the World's Power Core facility. <clears throat> so, how do these guys get these types of weapons on a ship like this that'd be next to impossible? Game logic, man. Just never question it. Can I bust this up? Oh, yeah, I can bust this up. Apparently, there's no water, though. Reroute the gas lines. Oh shit. Here's something running gas lines for you. Shit. Mm, wham! 
chain gang. That was pretty neat. Alright, so we route the gas lines. How was I meant to be? Yeah, no, I can't search these guys. Not turn orange. I don't think the last guy I killed turned orange either. How did so many get on board? Where the hell are their security force? <laughs> security force? Pete Challingham can't even find his own weapon. Remember, Kate? This is good. I'm gonna take down the other. He can't even find his fucking sandals, mate. <laughs> Disable secondary cycle covers. Alright, now I gotta go up again. Fuck's sake. Are those guys supposed to be dead? No, those are the guys I blew up with the fucking uh, the barrels. And it's great you give me these fucking. Okay, now I got some cover. Fuck you. Fuck you. All right, let's see if I can get out the wall. Jeez. Yeah, dump can. Can't loot that fella. Oh, is that another burrow? Boom. Back there's my real goddamn quick. I think this is supposed to be the largest ship ever. It was at least ten size size ten times the size of Titanic. change it all <laughs> and we're still wow I I literally did not even move the sticks all that much I held them in the same position the entire time <laughs> all right that's kind of broken Fools, you do not realize. <sighs> Vengeance. Great aim, buddy. Mine's better. <laughs> okay, now I can fuck. search them. The frequency key. Okay, scoot. I found the frequency key. And also another dipshit here who thinks he's tough. That was still alive over there. Drown. Oh. Well, that was pretty morbid. Alright, 
damage. Okay, let's go to Mavi. Oop. Cypher. Then we can show off that pet thing gas and move on to the VSD. Where am I going? Over here. Crypt. Maybe call by. <laughs> Considering it needs to have food, fresh water plants. That close to the size of Manhattan. Yeah, they never do offer an explanation as to how these places are supposed to thrive. <clears throat> at, least, at least in games like fucking Bioshock or whatever, you see that it obviously failed. <laughs> because how are places like that supposed to be fucking livable without the right amount of resources? I mean, we're talking about like trying to go to Mars nowadays. We're talking about like somewhere in the future we're gonna be going to Mars, but like gotta fucking take into consideration how exactly we're gonna make that happen. Sure they found traces of the water on Mars and such, but I don't find that to be good enough. Gotta actually make sure it's a sustainable living area. Not in the ass. Booker. I just know they have one chicken soup machine. <laughs> as long as we got that, we're fine. Oh, fucking hell. Really? You're gonna burst the pipes as soon as they fucking walk over there? Oh my. Seriously? <laughs> you can't fucking do that, man. Even if all the ice melted, the water levels they can only rise six meters. <laughs> if we can make it work in Minecraft, then we can make a city underwater. <laughs> Fuck. Mm. Stop with the pipes, you bitch. Damn fire pipes. I'm starting to hate fire more than I am water. It's just annoying. I think it's this. Nope. Okay, I'm looking. Water source, water source, water source, water source. Best to find the water source. There's your water source for you. Access fuel controls. Oop. There's a frequency key. VFD facility. Fucking nice. What is this item? What, what is this item? Say take item. Gotta show me what the fucking item is. 
What is the item? Give it to me! You piece of shit. Cipher. Creep. Nicely done. Did a sweet split. How that guy just didn't just explode with blood when he was in the <laughs> Loaded corpses, man. Dealing. Oh no. What a precious building. <laughs> no shit, Scoot. It's pretty been the whole game so far. Just water gates rising. Fuel supply. What? Where am I going now? I need to go back down. Oh, this well, this game is just going up and down and up and down and up and down and shit. Crazy. Pressure building. <laughs> Come on. I'm fucking working on it, man. Oh, shit, no, that's not it. Fuck. 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 Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Fuck. Where? Use. 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 Fuck. Ladder. Please. Kate. Faster, Kate, please. We're kind of in an emergency here. Oh, good. Laser walls. And I bet you if I walked up to them, I'd instantly die. Or they just don't do anything. At least they'd instantly die. <laughs> I'm waiting for Scoot to yell out, I'm giving it all she's got, Captain! But she takes anymore. She'll blow. <laughs> I bet that's what he's gonna say at some point. If he actually does, that's gonna be fucking ridiculous. Gel rounds launches a highly explosive gel that sticks to most surfaces on contact. Using a unique frequency, this gel can be detonated remotely. All right. Apparently, we're playing Arkham Asylum again. Okay, I found some ammo. We got a fucking explosive gel on us now. Changing ammo. Right. Yeah, I got it. Gel around the documents. So they just stole from Arca. Just stole! Yeah, they're, uh, taking it from Hey! Hi, hi, hi. You got ten seconds to live there, buddy. Better get that shit off you. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> I 
right, we got it again. Four gel rounds, thank you. Anything on you? Nope. Ow. You take a little bit of that. Have fun blowing up over there. Oh, well, not exactly settled. Uh, exactly settled. <laughs> well, I'll take that as a compliment. Please don't. Please stop being a simp, Scoot. <laughs> hey, let's do this quickly and get you the hell out of there. Oh, what? What? How? How even? What? Um, hold on. Uh, shit. What? What is that? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Hack fail. Damn it. Try that again. Kill yourself, thank you. Wait for somebody to tell me that. Okay. Then. That. Come on. Fuck. Oh, you fucking... Really? The one normal one at the end? That's just obnoxious. Exit the VFD facility right the fuck behind you. Surprise, bitch! Search body. Frequency key. Yes, sir. I gotta go on top. I gotta go on top. Oh, fucking way. God damn it. God damn it. Oh, you boys are done for. Fuck me, fuck me. How are you still alive? Shit, where, where am I even going? I need to go over here, maintenance access. No, I can't go that way. Shit, 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 shit. Where do I go? Fuck. Don't know where I'm going. Kinda made it not so obvious. It's encrypted. Fuck, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Give me a breath of air. Something. God damn it. Real question, it was a different one. Are either red lines or white lines? Cause, uh, I think there was a hole in the ceiling. Probably, but I wasn't able to see it. Yeah, you only know that for a while.
Take with the key. Oh, that was all on the ceiling. God damn it. Okay, why am I selecting the map before? Well, that's a ceiling fan. Can't get into that. So oh, shit. Access CCTV and Decided to go over here then. Rise up. One rise up. You fucking guys. They'd stop their bullshit. Okay. Maybe. Add Cypher. Yes, sir. Okay, now we're actually going somewhere. Thank God the encrypting is fucking good. Abby, please. Tickle the feet. Find the door. A function. From there now? I suppose so. Okay. Decrypt. The remaining VFDs are in the room opposite. The remaining VFDs are Oh, you fucking fool. <laughs> you thought you were safe. None of you are safe. Not as long as there's conveniently placed barrels around here. You were setting a mine, just like the others. I to protect the Hey man, welcome to the streamer. Or to keep people out of the loading bays. What was with that? Maybe, maybe they're trying to contain the survivors, stop them escaping. Yeah, but maybe they don't want anyone discovering what their real plan is. Is one of those fancy things up there? Well, I suppose it's time for me to go climb it again. Climbing on some pipes. Please. Uh, Kate. Could you fucking jump up on the pipe, please? You can go there. But you can't go anywhere else. Fucking like one of the wrong pipe. 
I have to jump up this pipe here. Oh. I do all the specific pipe that they wanted me to climb up. You bunch of butts. Why did they tell me to have a marker in this room and then all of a sudden now wants me to go the other way? What the fuck? Make up your mind, game! Oh, okay, I should have known that was gonna fucking happen. <laughs> Oh well. Mm -hmm. Seems like kind of my game. I wouldn't be surprised if it's the captain of this ship, that's the main bad guy. You know that's what this gonna fucking do. I mean, before you even saw what this game is about, you probably already knew that's what the fucking story was gonna be. He was setting a mine. Yep. Just shut up. <laughs> I already saw you. Here, then I guess not be in this room. Jump over to this red pipe. Right over here. Over this way. And then go right in. Jesus King, you are right. The loading bees are crawling on my fusions. You think it's scoot? Wait a minute. Yeah, right. A little play or what? You catch on pretty fast, kid. Oh fuck! I, wait, 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 hold up, hold up now. Crisis averted. Light it up, you bitch. Shit. Now all of a sudden it works. Fun. Why? And then they had to add the fucking one normal one in the end. It's so fucking stupid. Piece yeah, piece of cake. Yeah, right. Yeah. Just one problem. How do I get back out? Anything I'm supposed to look for? Body, get to the body, get to the body, get to the body, get to the body. Another frequency key. Loading bay access. Got it. Well now I guess it's about time to climb back up. Can't go through the door. 
shit, how am I gonna climb back up? Can't climb this way. Up, I... Alright. <laughs> I guess that's what I would do. Hey, go. Go up. Sit, please. Get into here. Scoot, did it work? Power to the port engines has been cut by 52%. Opinions on water? I mean, it exists. <laughs> I don't know what further opinion to expect on water. <laughs> they say office dick. Fuck. Oh, I didn't die there for some reason. But now it wants me to go up to this fucker. Extinguished gas jets. Well, time to get on the Mavi again. Boys, guess we're climbing. Or I guess we're not climbing. I'm gonna fly in the hell. Hey, Smiley! Haven't seen you in a while, man. How you been doing? Yeah, that's um one of my old subscribers, Smiley Face Cutter, that's been around the channel. I haven't seen him in a fucking while, man. How you been doing? Didn't think it'd ever show back up here, man. Well, there must be, huh? Well, good thing I'm about to die. And go up, go up, go up, go up further there. Ooh, that was almost a burden there. That was almost a fucky ducky situation. 
been moving and working, didn't have much time to pop in. How you doing? I've been doing pretty well myself here, man. As you can see, I've met quite a few new people on these streams. You go ahead and get to know them better. Fuck. Alright, uh... Down. I remember I can power swip. Kate, go down. For fuck's sake, go down. Power swim. Get the lever. I should do it, Kate. Just hold on. <laughs> Enjoying being wet. Never particularly no, because this game's called Hydrophobia. If anything, I'm quite perturbed by it. Bam. And there we go, that one. I don't know if that was a good idea. So... I empty the water just to fill it back up again. Great logic. <laughs> well, I guess we had to raise it up a certain way so we can climb up these pipes. Or if I can even climb up these pipes. We're being held against our will, goddamn Ariel. <laughs> so, Smiley, um, what kind of stuff have you been up to since you've last been here? <laughs> yeah, Arrow always likes to run a thing that we're always in a hostage situation. Arrow <laughs> said, No, do not fucking even joke about that, man. I do not want that. <laughs> no, I didn't. I do not want that held on my head. <laughs> That's not at all what I'm saying. <laughs> Yeah, this is basically the extent of the chats I have in stream right now, Smiley. <laughs> I've met some very interesting individuals in the last couple of years, as you can plainly see. Well, fuck, I guess I have to find that right now. There's something I gotta go over here. It's like down there somewhere. It's like right at the bottom. Here. Can I jump over this fence? Do you use the gel bullets? No, I have the sonic ones on right now. 
to figure out how to get the right level. I guess that's how I get over there. They're like just loading this shit up with more water. That's all we're doing. Oh, it's nice to have victims. I mean, friends and shit. There's a gang of people claiming they were the characters of. Ra yes, the Vanderlyn gang raided my fucking streams on more than one occasion. That was the best thing that's happened so far. When I was streaming uh, Undead Nightmare, the uh, the Red Dead One pack thing, <laughs> there was basically eight people who posed as different members of the Vanderlyn gang, like Abigail Marston, Arthur Morgan, fucking Dutch Vanderlyn, Hosea Matthews. And I have no idea if it was one person or if it was multiple that were doing it, but they were basically all posing as the Vangelin gang. And they just raided my fucking streams. It was probably the funniest thing I've experienced in streaming so far. Yeah, it was goddamn ridiculous, but I loved it. <laughs> fucking hectic console, Kate. God damn it. Kate, what are you doing? Hack the fucking console. Are you fucking serious? I have to look for a goddamn cipher and all this bullshit. Vanderland always has a plan. <laughs> okay, keep, keep moving. Semi-auto rounds. Semi-automatic ballistic rounds are only to be carried by the Queen of the World's security force. Hold on. Didn't get another time to switch, man. Okay, and here's. Turn that around, yes. Fuck uh, Gonna switch to the gels. Gonna switch to the jelly boys. Wherever they made. What, where? You're over there now? Fuck you. Piece of shit. Alright, back in here, back in here, back in here, back in here, god damn it. Where are they fucking... Fuck you. Uh, don't make that one accord. This whole time I thought no mods exist. Little did I know he was in hibernation like the Avatar. Cipher, I guess I gotta add. And I gotta go over here. Lovely. Hey, uh, go fuck yourself there, buddy. Yeah. What the fuck was that? It led to the fucking hacking console screen, but messed up. Free the security officers. Alright, well, how do I do that? Is there a way I can, like, go down somewhere? I 
I guess there. She almost there now, Kate. Just need to find a way through and get the cipher for the shuttle plaza. Then we can finally get you off this deck. Finally get me off this deck, huh? Sounds like a likely story. Power swim, Kate. Hold on. Can I breathe up? Ugh. Swim back up. Did I mess up the name of this game? Isn't hydrophobia mean... Doesn't have to follow me in fear of rabies. I don't know. Shit, Kate, the Maltesians are here. Skid, get out of there. No. It's all the word hydro and just like, oh, wait, water. Yeah, let's fucking do that. Just leave now. I'll be right behind you. Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Damn it. I've got company. Shit, Kate, the Maltesians are here. The Malthusians are being a bunch of fucking pussies. Get out of there! No! Not yet. They don't even know I'm here. Skid, just leave now. I'll be right behind you. To your boss. There's a cipher in there, and I'll get you into the shuttle plaza. You need to find it. Okay, probably should have been behind there. Damn it! I've got company. Shit, Kate, the Malthusians are here. Skid, get out of there! No! Not yet. They don't even know I'm here. Skid, just leave now! I'll be right behind you! Listen to your boss. There's a cipher in there, and I'll get you into the shuttle plaza. You need to find it. Mm. You guys heard that trying to live in the ocean for thousands of years and now going to be more adaptable in water than other people? I am not! But I've heard of that happening. Gonna explode up my fucking burl. Hold the breath for 15 minutes. The place is falling apart, but they'd rather just waste time fighting you instead of escaping. Yeah, that's how it tends to be. And that box is just sweet flipping here. <laughs> that's probably who just did that from the get go. I mean, if they want to die, I shall oblige by their means. Yeah, you thought I couldn't get through that door, did you? That'll keep the find a cipher. God damn it! Find that cipher. All I've been doing in this goddamn game so far is just going around finding ciphers. Oh, these are good guys. Okay. Thank you, friends. Plaza access. Oh, that's not right. Oh. There's yes. a cipher. That's it. Okay. Right, we just need to get you back to the plaza. You'll be able to get to the emergency sterile from there. <laughs> <laughs> They're called dolphins. That's another act cleared, I guess. Thank you, friends, for taking my cover spot and not shooting. <laughs> oh, shit. Kate, they're coming this way. Shit. I've got to run. 
Turn to cycle converters. Yeah, you, you just said that. I know. Turn to cycle converters. I got it. Fucking hell. Oh, fuck. Okay, you know what, buddy? You need to take a nap. Not tired of your shit. Yeah. Energy rounds. The EMC high energy round is essentially a supercharged microcapacitor, which releases a lethal dose of electrical energy to all objects within a fixed radius of the point of contact. Effective range is increased when deployed near water. Unlike gel rounds, energy rounds will inflict negligible environmental damage. Well, alright then. We gonna shock some bitches in the water. But not with my pistol, it's not. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> this is a mistake. How is there fire in the water? Water in the fire. Why? <laughs> Why do I hear a creepy child laughing at me? Turn to shuttle plaza access. Will fucking do. Whatever the hell that is. Reroute the gas jets. As soon as I can figure out how the hell to get up to that. Oh, ladder. 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 Or stairs. Not ladder. Get, please. get up. Get up. Get up. Damn it. She takes a few seconds to get out of the goddamn water. You want a ship or something? I'd say it's more like, uh... Uh, what would you call it? A fucking... Eh... Like an underwater, um, facility of sorts. Okay. Get up, get up, get up. Oh, there's fucking wires up there, too. Great. Local sewage cleaner simulator 20 then. Fuck's sake. Get up, get up. Alright. Fuck those wires. There. There we go. Now we got no problem. Let's side of that problem. Alright, you know what? You fellas are getting the energy. You fellas are getting the energy, thanks. Don't even care. I'm not supposed to get in there. By this? Oh, I guess I was already open. <laughs> Shaming me. The console's 
Do you want to try some Nautica someday? I could try some Nautica if I ever get my hands on it. Got to go down. Fucking hell. Swim your sweet ass off, Kate. Y'all can't fucking get me. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Okay, get in, get up. Get up, you fucking... Oof. Where's the console? <laughs> wow, that subtitle really looked urgent there. Where's the console, period. Why not you bitch? Fuck! I got right to the normal one. Uh, God damn it. Fuck mm. faster, you bitch. Don't even shoot your head. Don't even care. You block. This is supposedly not a very long game either. I looked it up, it's supposed to be like two and a half hours or something. So. We should be almost done with this. I don't know how much longer we've got. You're just now saying this? When you've been in this. Fucking hell for the last hour and a half now. Or almost two hours. Access the shuttle plot. Oh, I gotta go down there. Shit. Shit, baby. Okay. 
is we're going down, down, down to the bottom of the sea. <laughs> Can I remember that fucking line there? <laughs> From one of those unaired SpongeBob episodes. <laughs> or hardly aired SpongeBob episodes, not unaired. Okay, hold on. Get a breather. And then we go. Alrighty. Mila. Tell the world your name. Officer Bailey. That's Mila. Tell the Tell the people why you give your life to serve this pitiful ship. The queen of the world shows there is hope. That mankind can survive. The real world is dying, Officer Bailey. Slowly. Oh, painfully. that's awful. Bailey. We have the power to end the agony of billions of people forever. Shouldn't we act? You sick bitch. <laughs> You can die only once. We each that. <laughs> Yodo, as they say. Yodo, as they say. And to think this predated YOLO. Two hours of trying to match the sinking of the Titanic. <laughs> Paper or plastic? <laughs> Fuck's sake. Mila, she's behind everything. She smuggled the Malthusians on board. You mean to tell me that the villain of the game was the villain of the game? Say it ain't so. Oh well, you. Those guys are dead. Eat stop. <laughs> yeah. That's the kind of shop I like to go at. It's the fucking eat stop. And coffee station. You fools. Fuck. Okay, probably should have stayed behind that cover. They just say bastards. Oh, now there's not guys over here. Oh, hello. Bam. And boof. Rapid fire rounds. Converse the LP4 into a full. <laughs> Getting gunned down in front of the eat stop is just sad. Yeah. I wonder what other kind of stores we got. We got Habitation City, Shuttle Security. And also shoot this fucker. We got Media Shack. Not Radio Shack, Media Shack. Was that the Subway logo? Yeah, it's basically <laughs> Eat Stop. Go eat. Pre order online for quick pickup. Ah, this is years before DoorDash. Uh, fucking stand still, why don't you? Frick. Yeah, what else we going on? Proper brokes. I imagine that's like a thing here. Like a bank thing. Bet real time over H Wi Fi anywhere on the ship. Elevators over here, of course.
The tagline for eat, stop, is go, eat. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're in the business of confusing people. They're in the, they're in the market of gaslighting and passive aggressiveness. XJM Sushi. They got multiple fucking billboards for Eat Stop. What is this? Virtua Ungisip. That's just a bunch of gibberish. Let's go to the Eat Stop here. Yeah, I'd like a heart clogging clobber and uh, two sides of Deadly Ranch. Well, seems they're not open. Uh. Coffee station, waking up your day. Apparently it wasn't awake by itself. Right, where the fuck am I supposed to be going? Do I come over this? No. Do I go over on the other side? Tell me I go up there. They serve submarines that won't get soggy with all this water. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Well, that was dumb. Oh my god, all the way back here. Fuck off. Fuck, I can vault. I can vault. What? I was behind cover. Was I not far enough behind cover? Guys blow up. I'm off for the heavy auto. I'm gonna fuck now. Now if I can't tell if my combo was hidden or not. Oh no, I just didn't see it. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, people that eat stuff. Be like, are there sandwiches you want to pre-order? We can add sub protection for only five extra dollars. <laughs> Yeah, sorry, I just didn't see that. <laughs> okay, so these semi auto rounds suck ass. They're nowhere near as powerful as the Sonic round. Oh great! Put the fucking tree on my way, asshole. Okay, rapid fire rounds. Those are probably gonna be useless. Wires. Put another prick over here. Yep, there he is. How are you still alive? Okay, so I gotta cut these wires here. 
before anything happens. Oh, well. <laughs> you already done the exploding for- oh my goodness, Jesus, oh my lord, where are they coming from? Don't go to that one, God. Get off that one. Go to this one. Now she's talking to herself. Look, I can't. Are they behind? Where the fuck are the enemies at? Object. Official anniversary big boy hat. What the fuck? <laughs> 100% sponge, one size fits all. What? Okay. Apparently there were collectibles in this I haven't been getting. Where the fuck? Oh my god. Okay. Well, I think I got a checkpoint there, so I should have to go all the way back. Okay, guys, there Spongy had to soak all that sweat up. Yeah, I guess that'd be good for something. Son, bitch. And boink. Oh great, this wire's over here too. God fucking damn it. I gotta get up there, fuck. Oh, what are you guys- oh my god. You people, you people, you people, you people, you people. I hate you. Shoot him, please. Fuck off. Ugh. Use the sponge to soak up all the water. Well, yeah, but then the sound would be all sponge, wouldn't it? the shit. You're getting the shit. All sponge, no bob. Oh lord, that guy went flying. God damn it. There we go. Oh, fuck it down there, huh?
sick. Let's die. Piece of shit. Make your legs all jelly. Oh, there's guys down here too. So that explains why everything was all shooty. And you're fucked. Oh, there he goes. I swear to God, the signs of the one. The store signs of the one shooting at you. They're plotting against me, damn it. <laughs> they want to be the only ones who can give excellent service. Yeah, and we climb up. Yeah. Just keep on climbing, keep on climbing, keep on climbing. Oh, I gotta go. Oh, fuck me. Alright. Well, fellas, guess we gotta go climbing again. Thanks, we got our wrist. Oh, lord, no. Well, no way back down now. Just gotta keep on a cloud. But I think can I move? Thank you. Scoot's dead. Scoot done died. Maybe we didn't see any signs of it, but Scoot's fucking dead. He's gonna be okay. He has to be. No, oh, he dead. I shot with my own two testicles. Yes, my testicles can see what about it. <laughs> See how much he got before. Oh. God damn it. He told you to get off the set. And that's what you're doing. Am I? D cell shuttle departing short. D cell. Scoot. Oh, don't tell me we're going to be fucking. Platforming now. I just break the fucking. Mm. Well, I guess I can't. Okay. okay, so what the hell am I supposed to do here? I have to fucking look around for a cipher of sorts. Elevator. Walk. No, there's not one in here. Is there one in here? No. Well, fuck, I have no clue, and I'm also getting shot at. Cool. Uh, 
shit. All right, I was stuck on top of there. About to jump over. Nope. I don't know where I'm going. What the fuck do you want from me, game? Oh well, I guess. I guess we just had to wait for the fucking water to rise. Water to bed, water to rise. <laughs> Had to be off now. Maybe back the stream is still going on. Yep, good enough, sir. I'll just have you when you can. I can't leave you, Scoot. I can't do it. Just leave him, woman. He's fucking useless. I don't think I have much of a choice. Because uh, the water's rising up pretty fucking quick. Oh, now this way's open? Fuck off. Uh. Oh, you, 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 you can fuck, can fuck, can fuck off. Aim at him! You fucking prick. Rescue Scoot, alright. Are you serious? The reticle was red and it said I didn't fucking shoot him. That was the biggest load of horse poopy I've ever acknowledged. What the fuck was that sequence? Did you see that? That is not. Oh no. Checks in the mail, asshole. Oh, Billingham. You made it. Not bad for an engineer. Here. I think you dropped this. Scoot. We've got to save Scoot. Well, there's as much saving them now. And act complete. Survivor. We got a lot of gamer pickers and avatar awards. And that's it. That's fucking what? <laughs> no, we leave the fucking facility. No, we actually save Scoot. No, nothing like that. Are you fucking kidding me? That's literally all. Three people named Jones in a road. Andy, Deborah, and Peter. Y'all should be ashamed of yourselves. <laughs> Mike, Northeast. You think his brother's name is Jim Southwest? <laughs> oh my lord. Yeah, it just fucking ends. What the hell? Chris Janikov. Giovanni Cooper, some I don't know how to pronounce that, pronounce that name. Steve Molyneux, part project, I don't know what that means. No wonder they remade this game for Steam. <laughs> yeah. well, I don't know what that's like, but I hope it's better than whatever the hell this was. Ming Trenunging, Trenunging, Kevin Longair. <laughs> Uh, did he have his name as Kevin and Kev in the credits? You shouldn't be. 
Who needs an ending? Yeah, what do you... You think you're owed an ending because of your consumer? <laughs> you're fucking stupid. We don't want to use shit. <laughs> oh, let's see the script writers. Rob Hewson, Pete Gomer, Deb Jones, Peter Jones, based on an original story by Peter Jones. Great. What the fucking hell? And everyone drowned at the end. Yeah, literally, that was just such an abrupt ending. I thought maybe there'd be another act after that. Like an epilogue sort of thing. But no, they just cut to credits. Like, that's it, everybody's dead, go home. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> what the hell, man? Ah, boy. Well, that was Hydrophobia, I guess. Didn't expect it to end so abruptly. I mean... I heard it was a really short game, but I figured it would, like, have a little bit more substance to it, you know. I figured there'd be something there. I thought it was going to be a completely different game, like it was going to be, like, a more of a horror kind of game. I thought it was going to be, like, a horror game of sorts, where it's like, you're having some sort of, like, flashbacks to when you had, like, a tragic accident when you were swimming. Like, you're, you sort of, like, can't stand the water. I figured that's what it was going to be, like, you're trying to help people out, but you're constantly in a water-like environment, and you have to fight around that. But no, there's just three acts in everything, in total. So I found this is going to be episode one. One of three, but the other ones didn't come out. Ah, oh, that would explain it. You have now unlocked the challenge room. Good. What's the incentive to do that? I don't fucking know. Let's at least check out the challenge room and see. Before we go, let's at least check out the challenge room. See what the fuck that can offer us. What the fuck? What? What was... She could apparently have electric abilities now? When the fuck was that established? The challenge room is an intense, action-packed arena of combat where every second counts. Fight against the clock in five tense rounds against increasingly difficult enemies. Maximize your score by manipulating the environment using your hydrokinetic abilities. Don't forget to restock your ammunition between rounds. What? <laughs> hydrokinetic abilities? That was never a thing in the story. What the fuck? Music video room. Yeah. When did she get hydrokinetic abilities? That was never a fucking thing. Was that part of the failed episodic progress that we were supposed to learn? Oh, what in God's name? Okay, well, I immediately failed. Okay, well, I think that's, um, I don't think I want to see any more than that. I don't think it's worth it. So, yeah. That was Hydrophobia. A completely different game than what I was expecting. I thought it was going to be some kind of horror game of sorts. Kind of made this an oddball episode of Horton's Terrific Halloween, but, hey, fuck it. It had Phobia in the name, I went with the idea of it being a horror game. Man, this is... This is a lot more cluttered than I expected it would be, man. Like, just the abrupt ending of everything and the fucking... You know, everything now just not really coming together. Like, we didn't even find out if Scoot was still alive. It's like, we've got to save Scoot 
and then they all get flooded and everything is there. The horror was just how bad it was. Yeah, certainly. Yeah. But, anyways. We'll probably go back to some real horror stuff tomorrow. Um, if I go back into my things here. We still got Decay the Mayor. Which I, in case you missed it, I played uh, Decay yesterday. We were playing Decay the Mayor. Then we've got Amnesia to go through because I played a little bit of it last year, but I didn't really get too far in it. It was on the tail end of my Slender the Arrival stream. And then um, The Evil Within, which I will get through, possibly through here. I wish I would have gotten more interesting kind of games this year, but again, I don't really have much money on me right now, so I couldn't really afford to get some. That's why Ariel offered to uh, send me the Ghostbusters game, which, again, thank you, Ariel, for that. I greatly do appreciate you offering to send that over to me. But, um, yeah, that's um, going to do it for this, for today on uh, Horton's Horrific Halloween. Um, I'm not sure how to space out the other games now. I think Decay of the Mayor we can do in one single episode. And then, of course, we've got the Amnesia games, which has, like, the um, fucking... Uh, the Dark Descent, Machine for Pigs, and Justine, I think, is on there. Which is essentially a mod for the Dark Descent. It's been fun. Yeah, it's especially been great to have you back, Smiley, because I have not seen you in the longest time. I hope you've been doing well on your end with whatever work you've been doing. It's nice to have you pop in here. Hopefully you can come back into uh, more streams here, if you can come back into like um, the rest of the streams that I have planned for this week. or the Or like the rest of the month. Because I do tend to uh, do this um, Halloween marathon thing like for the whole month. So hopefully I can see you in a couple more streams down the line. <clears throat> and hopefully with November coming up I can get back to some old series that I haven't really gotten to. Glad it's working out for you. Yeah, finally things are working out for me on this channel here. Like, I don't know if you noticed, but I'm at 146 subs right now. That is the most subscriber base I've had... In my entire 13 years of being a YouTuber, like, that is fucking insane to me, man. Just, I've always been stuck in, like, either single digits or double digits or whatever the fuck. But now that I started streaming last year, it's been um, a continuous process of, like, getting in new faces and having more fun experiences with the chat and having good conversation pieces and such. I definitely think that streaming did help out my channel for the better here. I'll be around more since I'm settling in. Well, that's nice to hear. Hopefully you'll be able to make it for well, many more future streams. It's great. You don't, yeah. And interesting thing, Smiley. I don't know if I told you this here, but um, basically when the whole COVID thing started, like, um, like a few months into it, I was almost ready to give up on everything because I was just like, I've been pushing at this for so long, like trying to make something happen. I was just like, at, I think it was like October of 2020, I was just like, fuck it, I can't fucking do this anymore. Nothing I'm doing matters. It's just like, I think that was the first time I ever felt like seriously depressed, where it's like I didn't feel like doing anything at all. Where I just like wanted to give up on everything that I was trying to build up. <clears throat> but thankfully I found um, some people around me. My buddy Chad, who goes by They Call Me Hat Guy. And uh, his girlfriend, Nikki, they do stuff to there. And his community in general that I'm able to find. Which is basically where I found the people you met in today's chat. Like Bjorn, Monarchy, Ariel. Um, and there are a couple others that you might see from time to time from Chad's community. But yeah, he's been a big inspiration for me. Because he actively went out of his way to try and help me you know, grow my channel here. Which is something I've never had in my entirety of being a creator. I've always had people be like, hey, good luck to you, man. Just fucking keep working on it. But nobody ever actually went out of their way to help me out, like, trying to build my fucking channel here. Chad was the first one that was actually like that. And I am truly indebted to him for that. I haven't talked to him a good while because he's been busy with, like, moving into his new place. So hopefully I can make some time to talk to him soon. But, yeah. It really is great that you also came back here. Yeah, And again, I hope you're doing well with whatever work you're doing. And I do hope that you can come by to more streams so you can join on the fun there. 
It's amazing. It sounds like you found good people. Yeah. Finally found some people that I could actually, you know, connect with and feel like I'm a part of something. Which was um, a little bit not possible in the last community that I was in. And I'm sure you're fairly familiar with that, Smiley. I'm not going to go into details of it because I just kind of want to forget that part of my life. But, you know, it's... I'm more devoted to doing things for YouTube now than I have been. I'll just leave it at that since I've managed to find a place where I can actually feel, you know, I belong somewhere. But anyway, this this ending got a little <laughs> too um, sentimental here. I'll just um, end on the stream. But yeah, this is actually a pretty fun stream. Special thanks to you, Smiley, for coming in here. And thanks to my regulars, Bjorn, Ariel... Uh, let's see who else, else is here. Bjorn, Ariel, Matt Way, also. He's from uh, Chad's there. And Monarchy. Everybody who's in the chat today, thank you so much for being here. And to anybody who's lurking in the chat, if you um, if you feel interested in joining these streams, I tend to stream every Monday through Thursday at 11 a.m. EST. And currently we're going through a Halloween marathon right now, so if you're interested in seeing whatever kind of spooky stuff I got on here. More emotional than the ending of that game. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's just... This is something I care about, man. <laughs> this is truly something that I care about and I want to make it happen. But, anyway. If any of you are interested in these kinds of streams here, if you are new to the channel, highly urge you to subscribe and share the channel around with as many people as you can. <clears throat> I was planning a goal for possibly hitting a thousand subs by the end of this year, but now I'm sort of trying to get to like 500 at the least. Because they added a new thing in YouTube Studio for 500. I don't know how it's going to work out, but anyway, that's all I got for today. So, thank you all so much as always for tuning in, and be sure to sleep with one eye open.